hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel tips by anil so in this video we will see how we can group by a choice field in sharepoint list okay so if you will see here we having the branch and branch is choice type i'll show you this is my list setting and in the list setting you can see branch is choice type okay so here are two choices okay and if you will see here on the basis of this branch what i want to get i want yeah i want to get this revenue actually so how we are getting the revenue the revenue we are getting on the basis of the branch okay if you will see here the branch column and here you can see the price so basically this is client registration of uh, sharepoint list and here we are registering a client for the fitness app and here is the prices okay so suppose i want like in a month in a month of july month of september or month of october or month of june what is my collection what is my revenue okay so if you will see here you can clearly see like this is the branch and for this branch we are getting in july 2023 40 000 and in june 80 000 and may is 60 000 and april is 10 000 okay you can see the graph here as well now if i choose the another branch okay then here you can see we are getting the data on the basis of another branch okay and we are doing group by by the month as well if you will see here we are getting the complete group by by july and in the july we got the collection for 94000 and in the june we got 40000 in the may we got 10000 and in april we got 60000 okay so this is the dummy data i created for you now i will show you how we can get this so if you if you will see here we have a registration date field so on the basis of the registration field we are getting the data for a month so suppose here this is for june 10th and this is for may this is for june this is for may this is for june and this is for july i want to collab all the price you can see here on the basis of month and on the basis of the branch okay so i want to group by this now i'll show you how i have achieved this so if you will see here i'll just make as a format text so if you will see here i created a collection you know right we what we can do if you will see here in the group by group by can be apply only on the text field okay we cannot group by choice type of column so what we will do first we will convert our choice type of value in a single line of text okay then we can try the group by now you will see here here we are adding a column and the column name is month name and the value is registration date and from the registration date we are getting the month and here is year so we are also going to group by to the year so if you will see here the year and we are getting the year data from the registration date now the most important thing is branch name so if you will see here we are getting the data for a branch this record dot branch dot value and we are holding in a branch name now what i will do i will go here and here you can see we are getting this uh, data in a collection call expand date now this call expand date i'm trying to group by using the four columns month name year branch and this is my group month by year okay so here i'm also uh you know uh getting the total 
it will see here in the my application i'll show you how we are getting the total as well now we are doing the total of the price month by year okay and month by year basically month name year and branch and here this is a switch so why i use this switch i'll show you if you see here the switch is basically uh, we are ascending or descending the months you can see april may june and july so this is the reason we are using the switch and here you can see the total revenue of year 2023 so if i'll go for 2022 you cannot see anything here but if you're going for 2023 you are getting this total but for this hinjewadi branch okay and if you will see here the branch i just changed you can see the data okay this has been changed the chart has been changed okay and if you want to compare this then what you can do you can just go here and export this data and you can uh, compare the result as well so i compared already and it looks good for me okay so if you want to copy this formula you can copy from here okay then <clears throat> here we getting a new collection group data okay so if you want i just apply this filter here so that's why i created this uh, uh, collection and this collection i bind it here okay and i'm trying to filter by branch name and filter by year okay and the rank that we are going to create uh, we, we are going to sort order as a descending okay so the rank i told you here we having this rank and this rank is basically like january is 1 february is 2 march is 3 up to so on till december 12 okay and here you can see the rank okay so this is the switch case on the month column month name column okay so i hope you like this video and if you like this video then you can subscribe my channel and share the video thank you watching Uh, my video have a nice day bye bye